guys, Liam here and welcome back to LSJ TV. Thank you for tuning in today. I want to wish you guys a happy, spooky Halloween. Drop a like if you're excited for today's video. We're going to be training, we've got a pumpkin to make, we've got a few things to do, we've got a lot to think about. It's going to be a good one. Let's get it started. Are you doggies? Go on then. Ah, oh, good girls. <laughs> right, before you guys comment, um, I wanted to just make clear that the title of the video isn't something to think about because of what I just said. Like, I'll go into it a little bit later. That just kind of it was on my mind, and so it 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 just came out. Don't worry, that's not like the topic of the. Anyway, right. You know what time it is? Oh, it's white monster time. It's white monster time. Oh! Ah. So, one thing I've been trying to do lately is, um, on my days off like this, just trying to, uh, well, at least trying to, or consciously thinking about actually getting dressed. And now I'm currently just like in an LSJ hoodie and my Sonic pajamas that you guys see quite a lot. Um, so I'm going to get dressed. I feel like it's going to help me be productive, help me wake up, and then, you know, I'll actually do something with my day. So, what shall we wear? No. No. I'll go for that one. Okay, so, before you ask, no, 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 no. That wasn't planned at all. I just, you know... On a serious note though, I have had questions about stuff like this, like LSJ stuff, literally on a daily basis for the last like two weeks. Know that I have plans, but those plans take time, those plans take money, and um, you know, I want it to be good, I want it to be right, but wait, why have I come downstairs? I need to be upstairs. Oh, by the way, I, I, I uh, made the bed. Do you, do you like it? Yes? Sick. It's supposed to be like some massive businessman, entrepreneur thing that you just do. Like you get up, you make your bed, you get dressed, and then you're going to have a productive, super amazing day. And so, I thought I'd try it. <laughs> what I do need to do though is prepare bags. I mean, I have a couple of things that means I'm staying at friends' houses and like need bags and outfits and all that kind of stuff for that. Um, but been thinking for like the last hour about what I should pack and what I need and to be honest I'm just dithering about so I just need to do it <laughs> Little uh, hint as to what's going on here. This is going to go in that bag. But, I mean, I just don't know what I'm doing, man. I don't know. Too much to think about all in one go. I've got this video, I've got work, I've got loads of other stuff. I've got. <sighs> Breathe. Breathe, Liam. Everything is going to be okay. <laughs> Come on. Okay, I'm about to show you guys something, but I'll only show you if you're not going to laugh. Are you going to laugh? Are you sure? Okay. Ta-da! <laughs> so with it being Halloween on the day that this video comes out, um, I have to actually, I'm actually in work on the day of Halloween and so we have to go in in fancy dress. Um, I have something for the night which you guys maybe see in the next video but this is going to be my work attire. Do you like it? Na, 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 na. Ah. So I just emptied my fancy dress bag, which is up there above the wardrobe. 
And I found this for some reason. This is the receipt from the first time I lent out a library book. Look, 19th of the 10th, 2017. So, <laughs> drop a like if you remember those times. The library feels. Oh, it's still coming back to me. Okay, shirts. And last but not least, socks too. Okay, right. That was a lot more stressful than it needed to be. Okay. Here goes nothing. <laughs> Woo! It's actually really good, you know. Yeah, man. We're happy with that. Thick. Oh. So today I have a lot to think about, right? And um, <laughs> I actually made a list. What do I wear to ocean? What do I wear to work? How many things do I take to work? Where am I staying? What do I need to do with my car? How much money do I need? Do I bring a fanny pack? What do I do about food? Will my haircut be done in time for the night? Hey, what clothes do I need for work? What do I need to do with my camera? Do I need charges? If so, how many? How much food do I need? You guys get the point. Um, I've had to do a lot more planning and don't get me wrong, this planning is going to be worth it because like, I'm gonna have a good time now with my friends, which is what I've waited to do for freaking months. Months and months and months. But, some things that I used to not have to think about, not have to plan at all, just, 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 I could just do it. I could just go with the flow and do it. I cannot do that anymore because I used to live in Nottingham. For one, this night out is in Nottingham, like, as you probably would have guessed. I live in Melton Mowbray now, which is sort of 20, 25 miles away, or 20 miles away, that, like, that way, right? I want to be that way. Not having a place of my own, um, or our own, you know, like me and my, my, myself and Charlotte, is pretty tough because it means it takes away an element of freedom, if you like, um, because usually we would have been able to say, yeah, cool, like, let's, let's go out tonight, yeah, cool, Pre's here, let's do this, let's do this, blah, 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 blah done. I wouldn't have to think about what clothes to wear, I wouldn't have to think about what to bring, I wouldn't have to think about work, I wouldn't have to think about what I'm doing, nothing. I could just go and, and enjoy and that was something that I always made sure to not take for granted because I knew that <laughs> I knew that situations like this would arrive and it'd be freaking complicated like right now I've got what what time is it now it, it, it's 10 to 3 my haircut's at half past 3 I'm gonna be going to Alex's and sorting out this video uh, uploading this video out again by like 5 6 o'clock and uh, it's gonna be hectic but I can't really complain about it because this is you know self-inflicted if you like this is me this is just well, it's it's life. Like this is what it's like. Like this is being being a student is 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 good. It's a good stepping stone between like living at home and having your own place and everything like that. You know, you grow up quick. You learn a lot about yourself. And as cliche as it sounds, you do. You know, you grow up fast. You're doing your washing. You're doing your cleaning. And you you know you, you're like an adult. You're on your own. But you are in a little kind of bubble you know you live up here in kind of dreamland where you get money from the government you can go out whenever you want you know you do your work when you have to but bottom line is you will never have as much spare time as much free time as you do whilst you are a student you will never have that again unless you have a job you know like this that allows freedom so having a lot to plan in terms of where i'm going to stay and you know all the things i just listed the list could go on and on and on Having all of those things um, means I actually have to be organised. And as stupid as that sounds, like that just comes with part of being a grown-up, right? That's just it's just life. That's just how it is. Like Liam, you have to, you know, you you, you got to grow up. You got to do this. You got this is what adults do, and that is a hundred percent right. And it, I, not that I'm complaining about it. It's just that I'm not used to it yet. Having to have some sort of routine, having to have some sort of structure to everything in life, rather than just you know little bits here and there it's um quite a shock to the system purely because it's like a simple flip switch 
Um, I use that term quite a lot when I talk about uni in terms of just everything changing, like complete polar opposites. But anyway, um, I don't know. It's I just wanted to kind of like, not rant or vent or anything, but I just wanted to chat to you guys about that. Let you know, you know, if you are about to be in that situation, if you're a third year now or, you know, a second year, just kind of loving life, like fair play to you. Um, know that this time will come. Um, everybody has to go and work one day. Um, so don't shy away from it. Just embrace it and, you know, be organised because otherwise you're not going to be able to see your friends. You're not going to be able to have a social life. And to be honest, guys, you'll just end up freaking miserable. So there kind of comes a point where you have to just say, right, okay, now's my time. I, 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 got, I have to do this now. Like, I have to do this. I have to grow up. I have to I have to have some sort of structure, you know? Um, and this is, is that time for me. So, you know, uh, that's... That's that's that. It's just weird, weird feeling that you know I I, I felt the need to share to you. You guys are like counsellors for me. Right? Anyway, right, I'm off to get this mop trimmed. Look at that, man. Oh my god. Um, I'm gonna have a fresh trim for my dip in the ocean. Uh, that's right. We are off to the famous ocean nightclub. I'm gonna be showing you guys that in the next video because I'm gonna be awake for a long ass time, and so. Stay tuned for that. Drop this video a like. Put your thoughts, put your comments if you have experienced anything similar to what I've just talked about. Um, if you kind of get it, if you don't get it, you know. If you have any questions about university or anything, just put them in the comments. I, uh, I reply to, well, every comment. So, um, yeah, thank you so much for watching, guys. Please drop the video a like and a comment down below. Subscribe if you are new to join the family, to join the graduation journey. Why did I say that really weird? <laughs> Once more, thank you guys so much for tuning in today. Again, drop a like if you enjoyed. I will see you in the next one.